And we have to act. We have to act now. It's not just to meet the moral obligation to treat our fellow Americans with the dignity and respect they deserve. This is an economic imperative, a growing economic consensus that we must act decisively and boldly to grow the economy for all Americans, not just for tomorrow, but in the future. There's a growing chorus of top, econo top economists that agree that at this moment of crisis, with this, with the interest rates as low as they are, historic lows, it is smart fiscal investment, including deficit spending. And they're more urgent than ever. You know, and that uh, return on these investments in jobs and racial equity is going to prevent long-term economic damage and benefits that are going to far surpass their cost. If we don't act, the rest of the world is not standing still in terms of their competitive advantage or their competitive possibilities relative to us. That our debt situation will be more stable and not less stable, according to these economists. And that such investments in our people is going to strengthen our economic competitiveness as a nation and help us outcompete our comp competitors in the global economy.